You received two complaints from customers yesterday. When? You weren't even here yesterday, and there were no complaints. Nobody was complaining, and I recorded the hunt, entire thing, and I left. I was only here recording the podcast. I recorded the podcast. People can hear it. Over 77 people have listened to it so far within 24 hours, and there was only one other guy here. There was a lady that showed up here that came in the middle of while the officer was talking, but the store has been empty the entire time. And when the, and when the, no, I mean, you know, cause you're going to lie to me. So, and I'm recording, so I want all of this in here. And I caught you texting on your phone cause you tried to create a situation about me being in here saying it was about me not ordering nothing. I ordered something, recorded it and it's on the podcast and I still got the motherfucking donut right here. So come on, lie to me. All right, well, I need all this proof because I'm going to sue the shit out of y'all. I'm so sick of this. Continue. All right, man. Yeah. We received yesterday two complaints from customers. When? What time were they? Give me the times and the, the dates. Time, but I got the dates right here. 11, give, 12. 11, 12, when? This was recorded by one of our managers right here. Give, give it to me. Give it to me. Lady in blue sweater. I didn't have on a blue sweater blue yesterday. Blue sweater. I have it on right now, and I just put this on. And I don't have on the same clothes as yesterday either. So, come on, let's turn this around. Lady in blue sweater. I didn't have on a blue sweater yesterday. Yesterday, I had on a black shirt and a a, a black uh, bikini top. So, oh, no, no, look, go ahead. I made customers uncomfortable. Let's, let's, let's do this. Okay, so today we're wearing maroon. And I threw this on just now because they just turned the air on. I've been dressed like this the entire time. Yesterday, I had on a black tank top and a black bikini shirt. But he says, I, he wasn't even here. And he's the one giving the report. And a customer said that. But he don't know that I saw him go outside and write that on the sticky note. Continue. Pull the sticky note again. Pull up the sticky note again and, and tell me these lies. All right, I didn't even have on a blue sweatshirt right, yesterday. Right. So a customer complained that I was using foul language. This is how the customers identified. This is how the workers who were working yesterday identified. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So there was different right. workers. Which one was it? I don't know. I don't check the schedule. Okay. Uh huh. And who are you exactly? My name's Kevin. Kevin. Exactly. Here. Okay. Great. So which which employee was it? Because it was the girl yesterday that called the police outside when I saw her take her headphones off, and the police officer that showed up went directly to her. She was also the one that just hid behind the counter when I was trying to purchase a donut and you came over here to talk to me like I wasn't buying nothing. And I just recorded it all on my podcast. So when people listen to it, they're going to hear you stutter and try to cover up your little lie. I also saw the group of girls who looked to be about the same age as you sitting out there on the patio. And when I showed up, how they looked at me and I don't know those bitches from Adam and I'm not your age. I'm probably 10 years your senior. So continue. All right. Not only did we receive the complaints, but the manager, the head manager, she's mm-hmm. out here right now. Mm-hmm has asked me to tell you to she the manager leave. asked you to tell me to please leave and she didn't even know I was here how does she even know anything about that and all I did was record a because podcast you complaints from. from who who are these random ass complaints coming from explain That's everything nice. I need you to because you're gonna have to show up in court and explain yourself uh, I can explain myself in court when I get more detail yeah uh uh this manager what's her name her name is Priscilla uh uh-huh. what's her last name I don't know her last name okay get a card or something baby let's go Man. Go get the card. We are recording. 149 people watching. Go get the card. I'm asking for it. You're telling me that this is coming from a manager. Go get the card. I need the manager's first and last name. Well, go find out. Go ask the other girl. She work here too? Go ask her. Go ask her. Go ask her. Not until I get all my answers. I mean, I can leave. This, this little pussy ass Dunkin' Donuts ain't shit. But continue. What's your name again? Kevin, what's your first and last name? Kevin, my last name is the last name. Ma'am, what's your name? First and last name? And I need the first and last name of the manager, too. What's your first and last name? First and last name. Your name. Because you're the one that called the police yesterday. First and last name. First and last name. That's fine. I'm going to put you on camera. Both of these people. So if you identify them and you know them on social media, yeah, pull your phone out, Heffa. Yeah, call the police, because that's what you were trying to do the entire time. And now I got you on camera. This is exactly the girl that called yesterday. This is him. Yeah, call. 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 So I can get you fired. Call. Call. Your manager, what's her first and last name? So I can call her. Because I'm sure about the caller. I'm about to call corporate and everything. Yeah, all right, bitch. Watch this. Crazy ass, stupid ass kids. 
Yeah, yeah. Look at him trying to come up with his story and talk to her because they made they planned all of this. Bored ass bitches in fucking Indio, California. Whack ass motherfuckers. Call. You about to lose your little job, bitch. Let's go. Yeah, it was cute. You thought it was a good idea. You tried it. Let's go. Uh, that bitch. That bitch that's getting you fired. You had a complaint against me, though. Right? You don't even know my name. Yeah. Ma'am, my ass. The man that's about to get you to lose your job, Kevin. And I'm still rolling. And it's 200 people watching. I don't have to wait for nobody. I don't have to talk to the police. The police gonna have to talk to y'all. Y'all created this situation. But you will be talking to a lawyer. Enjoy that. Hope it was worth it. In the bizarre twist of events. Can't wait. I'm about to get on the phone with y'all corporate. To the motherfucker that's texting me right now. Uh-huh. Hey, let me read this text message I just got to show y'all how people be planning it. Get all these motherfuckers. Get their face. Get everything. Get this guy. Get everybody. Get all of them. Get these bitches that he was talking to on the They ain't gonna let him fuck no way. He lame. <laughs> like, okay. And oh, we need the address. 4225L. Yep. Jump street, because I told them it's getting to a point where I ain't finna talk to nobody without a lawyer. I'm a